Hey, this is Scott with ideas about how to use Neverwet around the home. Today we're going to talk about lawnmowers. Everyone loves the, the smell of fresh cut grass, but for me, this is what my lawnmower typically looks like during the season. There's grass that's caked and gunked up in there, and you know, it's great outside, but you know, store your lawnmower inside the garage like I do, and it smells, and the kids track grass in the house, so I'm going to see how Neverwet holds up to fresh cut grass. So what we did, we cleaned, the, uh, cleaned out the bottom. We're going to, we already applied the, uh, the base coat. Remember, you're applying the base coat, nice even strokes. You're not stopping. You have to keep the, uh, the spray moving. You don't want to gunk anything up. Six to 12 inches apart. We went ahead and we did a, uh, the first top coat. So now we're going to do the second top coat. Make sure you shake it up. We shook it up pretty well. Shake it up beforehand for about a minute and while you're spraying. Six to 12 inches apart. Remember, you can always practice on a piece of cardboard to, to make sure that the, uh, the spray is, is good. And uh, we are going to, uh, typically you can wait 30 minutes. We're going to wait 12 hours now and see how it holds up the fresh cut grass. All right, it's been 12 hours. Mother Nature actually helped us out earlier this morning because it rained. So let's go ahead and check this out. That is amazing. Now remember, proper technique, if, if there's a little bit of sticking, go ahead and reapply the top coat again until you get your best performance. But this is incredible. You've got to try this.